guys are going my deadly mercenary family cosmic mercenary here bringing you a new video today we're going to be talking about injustice trailer and the power rangers trailer i can't believe i'm saying that but it happened the same week and i'm so excited originally i was going to put, put the injustice trailer for you know when it just came out but you know i decided to wait and make more editing and all that and i waited and now i get to do power rangers and injustice however before we start this video i just want to let you guys know that uh we hit 26 subscribers and uh we told we passed 25 uh, and i'm actually really happy i think thank you guys thank you guys so much uh remember always to keep liking that content and just remember that uh i'm so happy i'm so glad that this is actually catching on and you know I don't know where it's gonna lead, but I'm just glad I'm doing this because it's a lot of fun and it's one of my, you know, it's basically the only thing I could do when I am not working. And also, I just want to let you guys know from now on, it's gonna be a schedule every Friday. There is gonna be a new gameplay starting this week or maybe next week, but for sure, starting this month, every Friday, I'm gonna be uploading one uh, gameplay, let's play, whatever you want to call them, every Friday. And uh, it could be different things. It could be, uh, let's say, Black Ops 3, Dragon Ball Z Universe, Overwatch, GTA 5, Doom, and Just Cause 3. Those are the games I have. If you guys have any specific recommendations that I should really play, let me know. But those are the, one, the ones I'm primarily going to be putting up gameplay. So, you know, hopefully you guys enjoy that. Uh, and hopefully it get better if you guys didn't sell the last you know, gameplay. Just, just watch it. You'll, you'll understand what I mean. But even though I'm still doing those uh, gameplays, I am not. That doesn't mean I'm not stopping this whole DC thing. Doesn't mean I'm changing into like some sort of Vanos channel or some like you know Nogla channel. No, no, I'm doing whatever I want. It's my channel, and I like to game. You know why not do videos of me gaming? But you know, so this is my channel. I can do whatever I want. So I'm gonna be talking about whatever I want, whenever I want, except for Fridays because Fridays is gameplay day. All right, so let's start off with the Injustice trailer. Okay, so we all know that Brainiac's gonna be the main villain because we saw well, whatever you know what we saw, and you know this is a new trailer. And Injustice one was one of my favorite games that I played a couple you know all throughout this years, and I have been waiting for Injustice two. Um, what I gotta say about that real fast is the costumes look kind of weird. I, mean, I I'm not gonna get used to those costumes. Exactly, you know, the armors look great, but the costumes don't look as promising. So, you know, right off the bat, I have to ask, is this a different universe? Like, is this, is this really a different universe? Because it feels like, 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 what Lex Luthor said, and he's like, if you, ever, you guys obviously have played Injustice, if you're watching this, but if you have never played Injustice, in the beginning, Lex Luthor, they give you a quote in which Lex Luthor says, I can say, without a doubt, that there are infinite number of universes, some just like ours, but for one or two significant events, exactly the same. So I have must say, since there's infinite number of universes, could this be a universe where injustice, you know, of what happened in the injustice storyline, but different uh, outcome? Maybe Superman, you know, actually got out. Uh, Maybe, you know, could this be a different universe is what I'm trying to say. And I believe it is a different universe. So there seems to be a new character, and that's obviously Supergirl. And Supergirl goes to Metropolis, and this is what makes me wonder. Could this Supergirl be from a different timeline or a different universe? Or, you know, she just arrived and see the, you know, monstrosity of what just happened. And, you know, and is confronted by Batman and Wonder Woman and all that. Or, you know, could this be... It's like, again, completely different universe, but uh, Supergirl is gonna play a main role. I could guarantee that. Matter of fact, I, I could I could put place twenty dollars on it. It's gonna be one of the key characters of the storyline. So I'm excited to see what you know what is this all about. So you know, so you know, maybe she got blamed for you know maybe this is an injustice storyline where everything's okay so far, and then. You know, Metropolis is destroyed, and in the center, she is there. You know, like she's there, like, oh, she got framed. So, who knows? Maybe, you know, those are just speculations. Maybe this is not the outcome that was supposed to happen. Maybe the injustice storyline was never supposed to happen. So, therefore, Brainiac feels it's obligated to restart this this universe. You know, maybe, maybe that's just guess, maybe a stretch. So that's what I think about the injustice uh, so far, but uh, I'm excited for it. Are you guys excited? Just let me know down in the comments for that one. Now let's move on to Power Rangers. So before we start off this trailer, I mean, there's just one comment that I really love to, uh, you know, in in the comment section of this trailer uh, reveal, whatever you want to call this, and you know, basically it goes like, looking, check, cringe looking, check, fake looking fight scenes, check, destruction, check. 
Everything checks out. This is going to be a great Power Rangers movie. And I must agree, Mystic Dragon. It's going to be a great Power Rangers movie. Alright, so this morning Power Rangers trailer came out. Well, a new one. And man, man, I gotta say, I am in love with this movie and I haven't even seen it yet. And I'm not just saying that in Batman v Superman sort of thing. Like, no, I love the Power Rangers. I have a, a whole little stand right here. I don't know if you guys ever noticed, but I have, I have, you know, the Mega Force Rangers. And then I got, you know, we got Red Ranger from Mighty Morphin. And then we got the White Ranger from Mighty Morphin. And then we got, you know, what's his name? Uh, that new guy from the new, well, not the new series, from the Mega Force series, our uh, Robo Knight. There we go. I also have Robo Knight right here. And it looks pretty cool. Maybe I'll show you a picture right there. So I'm really excited for the Power Rangers movies for a couple of reasons. Uh, mostly the main reason is that they actually chose to do this near my birthday or my birth month. Uh, so I am really excited and man I am so happy that you know it's my birth month like oh my gosh yes. But anyways I got a couple things here and there. Um, so you know the first thing that really had, you know I've seen the other trailers and what really stood out to me is that they're, it's different. They're, they're going to be teenagers with attitude, and that's one take that I have never thought they would go with Power Rangers, but, you know, let's let's try that. And, you know, through watching this trailer, uh, something stood out, and one of the things that stood out was the Putty Patrol. And the Putty Patrol was it's weird, it's weird looking. I mean, in the original series, as far as I remember, is that... The, um, Rita Repulsa had this guy that made monsters out of clay and you know she made them into monsters you know but here it doesn't seem like she's gonna have this kind of help so I think what Rita Repulsa is gonna do is she's gonna basically just grab me maybe she has a whole you know like little parts and pieces like heads bodies you know maybe she's mad right and she like puts them together and makes the putty patrol and you know so that's probably one way that's you know that, that that's why they look like that that's why they have like two heads two arms you know maybe that's that's how they make the buddy patrol but i don't know it's my you know that's what i think is gonna happen we also see throughout the you know at one point point of the trailer is that reader pulsa is not all green i mean she has a different forms she changes she looks more like a weed witch not a witch like sandwich like sandwich but uh like she looks more like a witch and that is great that is Super fantastic to know that maybe, you know, again, I, I don't like to greet into a, like spoilers, but maybe she finds the green coin that they left behind. And that's how she becomes like greenish, sort of, you know? <laughs> and then the last thing that I really appreciated was that they're not just gonna go all out, you know, on the first try. Uh, they're not gonna just build into the Mega Sword and beat Goldar. Uh, what they're gonna do is basically just fight gold our first individual mega swords and that's actually pretty cool uh, so maybe they even form the tank who knows you know I mean the, the t-rex has the cannons for it I mean why not let's try let's try to do that you know but uh, yeah, no. so far I love it so far I love this uh, trailer and you know it seems really promising the other trailers seem like oh, okay and it's trying to be edgy it's trying to be dark but no no not this one this one's like oh no 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 don't worry guys it's gonna be a fun time it's gonna be fighting it's gonna be bad dialogue but you know, it really doesn't matter about the bad dialogue I mean Power Rangers has always had bad dialogue that's one thing that it's so fascinating is that such a thing became so popular Thanks for watching guys, if you like this video please give it a like, here are two more videos so you can watch then hopefully you will subscribe to this channel. Also here are my social media, hopefully you follow me, thanks for watching and as always stay vigilant, see you guys next time.